Hello, it's Alex Popovich and welcome to my channel. Today I will be talking about Clear Spaces application and why I'm enjoying using it lately. So let's dive in. This application works best on an iPhone and I would definitely recommend using it for it. What is it? It's the application that makes your iPhone home screen completely clear or it has capacity to do so. So I'll show you what I mean by that. This is my home screen on my iPhone and there is no applications at all thanks to clear spaces. But I can show you then my widgets as well underneath it. And this is my favorite thing. I can hide them or I can show them. If you want to have a completely clean uh, screen, you can use it like that uh, and then show up your widgets underneath it if you want to or you might not have anything. So how does this application actually work? Um, I mean, I've been fan of widgets for ages because I find them very easy uh, as a part of productivity setup to use. Um, I've used them before on Android when I used to have an Android phone and I went, I went back to iPhone, I missed having widgets. And um, so when they came back, I put them back into it and it's a um, great addition to my phone, but it does make the home screen busy, maybe a little bit less busy than um, applications and with the new application library I have very little applications on my screen. So this is the application. I went into the app library bought it and I believe it's around three and a half New Zealand dollars or something like that. So you download the application and uh, when you download the application this is the screen you're going to get into and uh, they have a really easy way how to use it. Um, basically it's this kind of a hashtag time sim symbol here and this is your widget center where you can set up your text if you want some text uh, a date and how you want the date to look like um, and you can customize it whether it's digital what type of stuff it is whether you want to show the battery the first step is basically choosing your wall screen paper so if you go into your settings and down into your uh, wallpaper, you can choose a new wallpaper. So when you do that, um, let's say stills, and you choose a wallpaper like that one, down in this is uh, there is always perspective zoom is on. Down in the middle, you need to take it off. It has to be off because what it does um, makes the impression of the 3D screen and this uh, application doesn't work as well. Or you might see that it's not clear completely that there is a, an image above it. Uh, when you've set up your wallpaper, what you then do, and I'll delete these widgets because it's easier to move stack. Remove stack. And so what you do is basically uh, tap your screen and add a widget. So add your first, your clear screen widget. And now it lets you choose whether you want just the uh, sixth of a screen, top, uh, half of the screen, or two thirds of the screen. And let's say we want to choose that one. And you just add it. What I'll do, I'll move it to the next screen. Uh, so now that you added it, you can choose whether you want it at the top, middle or bottom. And this is where it changes its picture. So for example, we want to put it in the middle and I don't want anything put on. You'll see that you have to move it to the middle so it doesn't show uh, as such. And then let's um, let's put that back on the top. So we'll edit the widget and put it on the top. Remove it. And then I'll add another, let's say, two-thirds widget as well. And I'll add that 
to the bottom. And then I'll add it to the bottom. And I don't want to show any information. On my um, previous screen, as you say, let's put that down now. Uh, I can choose not to have a digital clock. So I just choose different option if I don't want to digital clock to show. But I actually quite like having the digital clock in the middle of the screen. So now that we've done that, uh, you can have just an empty screen if you want to. All right, because you don't have any widgets put within the stack. But if you want to have some widgets that are part of the stack, you just add them like you would a normal widget. So we'll add a widget and up at the top, we want to add, let's say, my a Spotify um, widget. So I can choose now what I want and I want that half one. So I'll add the widget. OK, and then after the widget is in there, you just drag it on top to get into the stack. Now it's within a stack and you can just clean it or not clean it by wiping your finger up and down. So you just go like this on the screen. Yeah. And then I want to add another widget. Let's say I'm going to add my um, timery widget and I'll add this, this one like I had before. I just put add widget and now I'll have to drag it into the other one and yeah, the other stack. There we go. But you just add it on top of it and make it a stack. Now, if you want to add another one, you can easily add them. You just push down and it's finished. So now you can have a clean interface like that. And then you just basically do that and it disappears. So I quite like having a date at the top when I'm working because I can glance, I can see what the time is, um, or I can choose to have a nothing on it depending what I like. And um, I really enjoy having both options depending what my mood is for that day. This is a video from Clear Spaces Company and it shows you a little bit more the options that are available and how to set up different screens if you don't like the way that I have set it up. So what do you think of this app? Would you use it or not? And I want to say that this is not a sponsored um, YouTube video. I don't have um, any affiliation with Clear Spaces and um, I just enjoyed this application. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any comments, please write them down below. If you're enjoying watching these videos, please subscribe to the channel below uh, so these videos can come straight to your inbox and you don't need to miss any other future videos. If you want uh, me to look at certain application, please write them in the comments below or suggest them and I will look at them and see what I think. Bye for now.